Even. Okay. <clears throat> so my name is Myra, and I'm gonna do something that I can't believe I'm doing right now, but I'm gonna show you a transformation. I'm starting a business for makeovers, and I want to show you just how easy it is to change your whole entire look. This is exactly what I look like when I wake up in the morning, which is something that a lot of these girls are not going to show you. I'm going to try and do this as quickly as possible. Um, but normally my hair is, you know, like I straighten it out into a bob, but I look, I look crazy right now because it's like before I go to the salon to get my hair done, I'm Dominican, so I always go put the rollers in and straighten it out. So, I'm not really going to focus on the products unless I really believe in the products because I think you can do this with whatever. But I'm just trying to use whatever is left that people have given me. This is just a shine because I'm going to put a fake ponytail on. And um, I want to make sure that it matches. And usually if you have a fake ponytail, it's much shinier than your real hair. So I put some shine in. revealing the secrets here I am and then this is uh, a liquid gel this is from satinique which is uh, on a website I'll put the link if you want it it's a soft hold it's not really that hard hold if you have very coarse hair I definitely recommend that you use something with a stronger hold maybe this like got to be glued this is for vertical um, styles so that is a very strong hold I forgot to get the hair clip. Oh, it's on my hand. Okay, so all you do is you take a brush, a bristle brush, and then you just pull your hair back into a ponytail because you're going to put a ponytail on it. I mean, you can do a wig. You can do whatever it is that you want. But this is just a very quick way to get ready in the morning. Let's say you wake up late for work and you're like, oh my God. And you know there's absolutely nothing you can do to your natural hair to make it look good that day. You do this. Let me just make sure. Yeah, it's right where I want it. And then you pull it up. This is actually a little looser than I want it to be. I love people. Um, I think I put the last piece. Pull the last piece out. Okay. And sometimes, I guess some people like to pull their ponytail. I don't because I feel like whenever I pull the ponytail like that, it messes up everything I just did. So I don't do that. <clears throat> this is a ponytail I'm going to be using. No specific brand. Just get a ponytail. It has these little clips here. I'm going to clip it in. Put my ponytail in the center. Pull the string. Push that down, wrap the string around my ponytail because I want it to stay in. And then what I normally do is I take any kind of like bracelet that I used to have from whatever and I would take a bobby pin and pin it in, but I don't have a bobby pin right now because I wasn't completely prepared for this. So now I got my ponytail. Boom. Quick look. Wow. Totally different, right? Now I'm going to do a quick makeup. Very quick. This is how I do my makeup every single day. And I am missing something which I'm gonna have to go grab. So just give me literally. This is my tinted moisturizer by Artistry. I only use Artistry products on my skin because they are pharmaceutical grade, which means that they only have, I believe it's 0.01 percent bacteria so they're 99.9% .9 bacteria free all the stuff that you get in drugstores and stuff can have up to 20 to 40% bacteria I don't know I'm not trying to have any of this stuff on my skin I think it's disgusting so that's what the hair looks like and then I'm gonna put something here so you'll see so now oh and the concealer you're, you're gonna learn to love me I'm, I'm just that girl you know sorry so I bought this concealer palette from eBay. I'm not trying to give anybody props, whatever. Again, I don't promote a product unless I truly believe in it. This was like $5. You get all these concealers. I do professional makeup. Uh, I obviously do makeovers, but I also do weddings and brides and stuff like that. So I just need 
some type of concealer and this has every color it also has the, uh, the darkest and the lightest which to me is a big deal because we never know who's gonna be in the bridal party you want to make sure that everybody's satisfied so I just put some concealer there there and then I have like these dark spots here I always try to cover up and then the red around my nose because and then I just put a line down the middle of my face okay not gonna explain why watch other people's tutorials but you get it so I did